about your recent na pangyayari sa Panay Avenue na si 28, working a uh, uh, couple of barangay task force disciplina, trinay nila may arrest yung fish vendor. Uh, ang pagkakamali siguro lang nung uh, nung mga nag-arrest is gumamit sila ng sobrang lakas. Makikita natin sa video na may hawak yung isang nasik at pinagpapalo-palo niya ng several times yung fish vendor na unarmed. Walang dalang weapon yung fish vendor. So, panoorin natin yung action. Makikita natin sa CCTV na yung fish vendor, napaligiran siya ng mga barangay officials, barangay tanos. Yung isang lalaki, isang uh, task force discipline member, uh, repeatedly tinataw siya sa heads. With the intent siguro na gusto niyang isubdue o i-arrest para sumama, eh ayaw sumama yung fish vendor. Instead na hinataw yung uh, fish vendor, the guy behind, uh, nag-hug siya from behind, yan, yung single hand, gable grip, and then, hindi niya chucho, kundi dapat drinag niya nalang pababa until makaupo yung fish vendor. So, ito yun. isang possible na gawin din is the guy, yung, instead na pinalo niya yung suspect, yung, yung fish uh, vendor, instead na pinalo niya, the guy from the front could have executed a double underhook and trip, outside trip na take down. So ito yun, without using any weapon, swing your arms under the armpits, yan, and yung leg na to will do an outside trip. So from here, on trip, From the mounted position, uh, you, you need to break his will. Huwag kayo agad na from the mount, kasi sa realistically, papalagyan. He'll try to yeah, dismount you, i-reverse ka niya, bridge side to side, until may, may danger na, baka pag-bridge niya, he'll end up at the bottom. Okay? So it's important that from the mount position, huwag kayo magmadali you need to get your weight down sa kanyang uh, upper body. So, go down. Yan. You could negotiate. You could tell the suspect, huwag ka na pumalag. Huwag na. Sumama ka na lang. Hindi kita sasaktan. Ayan. And sometimes, with the legs, you spread, spread the legs like this. Ayan. From this position, slowly, climb up para magkaroon ka ng high mount. Ayan. From here, get get the arm. What what one of the arms na gusto mong iyan? No? So papalagyan eh. Yeah. Push one of the arm and i pressure mo ng sarili mong chest para buong weight yan. Kahit gaano kalakas yan, yun yung leverage base technique. This arm is not stronger against my whole body. I'm 145 pounds. This arm is not stronger than my 145 pounds body. Okay, from here, this is what you call lift wrap. Kunin yung isang kamay, ayan, and eventually you turn him on his belly. And still, you maintain that pressure. The other law enforcers, which we will show later sa video, should be controlling the hips and the legs. Papakita natin dyan sa latter part ng video. For now, yung arm na to, ayan, so... Maintain, well, maintain in this 
uh, pressure here to get this arm here and ito na yung to secure yan tapos yung isa kunin din pag ayaw niya ibigay sapot ayaw niya ibigay you could get this and you could choke him right here and eventually give the other arm pag ayaw pa rin then pwede mo lang kunin dito and Okay, pinakita natin kanina yung isang officer na anong ginagawa dapat dito sa upper body. And this time naman, yung isang officer, anong gagawin dito sa legs. Kasi one thing to point out, na kahit nakaposas yan, if hindi mo sinetear yung hips, tsaka yung legs, kaya niya pinatawag na build the house. Yung tatay mo siya, yan. At pwede pa akong sipahin niya at pakatakas siya. Yun. Yun ang danger nun. Sige. Karamihan kasi ng training is palagang nakafocus lang dito. Which nakakalimutan yung vital part ng hips at ng legs. So, the first officer needs to subdue this. And the second officer should do like this. So, from here, kukunin yung isang paa. Ibebend yung Knees. and then mag step over para yung weight ng buong body ko nandun sa isang legs niya tsaka dito sa shin niya while my arms are holding the pants or nakahawak ako sa hips niya hindi siya makakagalaw and may pressure ko pa ng weight ko from here itong isang leg na to yan, hawakan ko to at the same time, I'll hold this part here and i-bend ko siya. Tapos, yung buong body ko, ibabagsa ko rin. 145 pound is stronger than big muscular legs. So, I'm going to put my weight here. Hahawakan ko yung hips niya while the other officer is taking care of it. Thank you.